Hey there guys, it's Psycho Red here and I wanted to give you guys just a quick update and tutorial on iOS 10. It just released today, so without further ado, let's go ahead and get into how to install this onto your device. This is using uh, without a developer's account. And what I'll have is a link to uh, my Dropbox down below. You're gonna need to get a, uh, a developer configuration account. And it's um, kind of like one of those accounts that you would get through like vShare, where you would have to uh, manually trust in settings. So let's go and get into it. So when you go, uh, and actually when you click on the link that's in the description, you're gonna be taken to Dropbox. If you haven't created an account for Dropbox, you can go ahead and create one, or you can sign um, up with Google. So what I'm gonna do is I am going to sign into this and then I will be right back. Awesome, so once you fit, once you actually uh, signed into your Dropbox account, you're gonna hit the download button that's on top right here. And very small, I'm gonna try to angle this and get in a little bit as good as I can. There we go. Uh, you're gonna either, you're gonna hit direct download. You're not gonna hit save to my Dropbox, you're gonna hit direct download. So we'll tap on that. And this should automatically shoot you over to the settings app here. Let me re... There we go. So that's going to shoot you over to the settings app. We're going to hit the install button right here. And this is a profile that we need to install. We're going to, if you do have a passcode, go ahead and enter that in. And then once you do, you'll get a message about the beta pre-release. And then you just, you can either read through this or just hit install. Once you do, hit install one more time. And it's going to ask for you to restart your, your iDevice. So go ahead and restart. Awesome. So now that your device is restarted, we're going to go ahead and now install the uh, firmware onto your device. So under settings, I actually kind of want to make sure that you guys, sh or that I can show you guys that I am ni on 9.3.2 first. 9.3.2 with about 4 gigs. Let's see how we are after the software update. So you can hit software update over the air. And you won't even need a computer for this. That's, this is the great part of it. So here's iOS 10 developer beta one. So we're gonna go ahead and download and install this. Go ahead and put in your passcode if you have one, like I do. And then we're gonna tap the agree button. Alrighty guys, so once you get to the actual main page after everything has been installed, you'll notice your home screen, or actually your lock screen will look a little bit different. And if you slide over to the left, you'll notice the different widgets that you have on your uh, iDevice. And then also if you slide to the right, you'll notice that your camera actually comes up. So to unlock your device, you just tap on the home button here and it'll, act, it'll actually prompt you for your passcode. So go ahead and put in your passcode if you do have one. And I actually have this set to uh, go into settings. So just so you guys can see, iOS 10 is right there. So there you guys have it, how to install iOS 10 onto your iDevice for free. I will have the uh, Dropbox um, link in the description below. So go ahead and click on that. It's a really easy uh, download, uh, no real bugs or real ch any sort of like major things that you have to do with your iDevice. It's really simple, really easy. Now remember, this is a beta, uh, a first beta actually, that was sent out to developers. This isn't a public beta. So if you, uh, if you want to try out iOS 10, try it out, but don't expect it to work completely without any sort of flaws. I'm sure that there are tweaks and there are some sort of uh, glitches that may come about once you're you know, working with your different applications. And some of your apps may not work on iOS 10 just yet. So just be aware of that. This is a beta one and it's not supposed to be taken so seriously until the actual, like either until we get a gold master version or until we actually get the uh, official public release. So I hope you guys enjoyed the tutorial. Uh, stay tuned because I will be having a top tens uh, you know, uh, of my favorite, you know, features that we got from iOS 10 uh, video coming up. And I'm going to be actually checking to see if we can run GBA for iOS and the other different app, third party apps through iOS 10 on our iDevices. So stay tuned for that. And I hope you guys have a good rest of your guys' day. Subscribe, like these, uh, like these videos. It really does mean a lot. And if you guys do have any questions or concerns or comments, go ahead and leave it in the comment section below. And I'll be able to uh, help you guys out if you guys are ever in any sort of need. So again, I hope you guys have a good rest of your guys' day and night. And peace.